Good evening, everybody. Hello, good evening, guys. Hello, how are you? I'm fine. Great, thank you very much for joining on time, guys. I really appreciate your time. I can say, I can see Jennifer is here. Great to see you here again, Jennifer. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Le voy a compartir, Jennifer, un playlist de YouTube para que se ponga al día con las clases hoy. Perfecto, muchas gracias. Ya sabe, ahorita se lo voy a buscar. And how are you today, guys? Fine. Hi. Are you okay? ¿Cómo estamos? Very fine. Great. Yeah. Congratulations. Ah, is... thank you. <laughs> it's your days. Yes. <laughs> the teacher's day. The teacher's day, yes. I, I thought that today we had to the English class, but uh. <laughs> they're really smaller. <laughs> I know, I know that I also uh, thought about this, but no, we have classes today. <laughs> yes, it's better. Yes, it's better. Well, nice to see you and Daniel. Thank you for the picture you sent it to me. Okay. Mm, I believe this picture is not right. I mean, because this is not the first time that I saw that. And... I mean, the person who showed it to me before didn't have any inconvenience with the course. And uh, on top of this, you are sus I mean, you all are subscribing the in the model. Yes. Uh, you are not a listener, so don't worry. You will get the diploma. <laughs> <laughs> because say hey, that you don't that that's it include uh, to get mm -hmm. a certificate. Say don't get certificate yes and I, i'm sorry for that but i believe there there is a confusion on the system because this is i mean i, I remember uh one of the students showed it to me the same picture and asked me hey why it is saying this i am not a listener and i uh, uh and they i confirm and it was just like, a, I believe it is a glitch or something like that. It is an error on the system. So don't pay attention to that, Daniel, because you are subscribing the course. You are on the attendance list and everything. Don't worry. <laughs> okay, thank you for clarifying. You're welcome. Thank you for asking. Okay. Hello, hello, guys. How are you, everyone? Are you good? Hi, teacher. Hi, Marina. Welcome. Thank okay. you, teacher. Um, thank you very much for joining on time. Uh, we will continue. Let me see. Oh, um, Jennifer, you are not in the WhatsApp group anymore, or you are in the WhatsApp? I'm not and in whatsapp teacher not in whatsapp anymore um i need the link okay let me send it to you okay thank you you're welcome let me send to you mm, everything you need one moment Okay, let me see. Oh, 
Okay, here you have. I will send to you all the information, Jennifer, so you have it, okay? I already sent it to you on WhatsApp. Okay, okay guys, so today is Wednesday, the 22nd. All right. Um, happy Teacher's Day for the ones that are teachers, guys. Congratulations, okay? Jaime, Christian, and also you, Jennifer, right? You're a teacher, right? Yes. <laughs> okay, great. Congratulations. Thank you. Hi, teacher. <clears throat> Hi, teacher. Hi. Um, I'm sorry tonight I am a listener because I need to finish the project for oh, the okay. student. Okay. Oh, no worries. It's fine, okay? Okay, thank you, teacher. Don't worry, Jaime. Yeah. You're welcome. Okay, guys. So I believe we will start with the class today. I will share the screen with you. Uh, let me get a second. Do you see the screen? Yes. Perfect. Okay, so uh, the topic for today's class is how to use adverbs of frequency, guys. This is the class number seven. This is a review about the adverbs of frequency because you already learned this before. However, uh, we will go ahead and apply them and try to practice more about this, okay? Before practicing more about the frequency of adverbs, I would like to have a review about yesterday's class. Yesterday's class, we talked about the simple present. The simple present to talk about scheduled events, all right, in the near future. We say that whenever we're talking about simple present for special events, those events are not happening right now. Um, but actually they will happen, all right, in the near future, in the very near future, in a close future, okay? So um, we use this whenever we're talking about uh, repetitive actions, whenever we're talking about transportations, um, daily activities, etc. Whenever you have something planned or scheduled, okay? For example, the train leaves tonight at 6 p.m. In English will be like, el tren se va eh, esta noche a las 6 p.m. Okay? Um, así que pues, si ustedes se fijan, se dicen presente, pero en realidad is expressando un futuro cercano, okay? When the bus, when the bus does not arrive at 11, it arrives at 11 p.m. Sorry, the bus does not arrive at 11 a.m. It arrives at 11 p.m., okay? When do we board the plane? The party starts at eight o'clock. La fiesta empieza a las ocho en punto. La fiesta no ha empezado todavía. La fiesta no está empezando todavía. No está todavía. Eh, va a empezar a las ocho. ¿Ok? Por eso lo decimos en presente. Porque es un evento que está programado. Scheduled event. All right? So, um, the structure of the simple present is the same. Unless we're talking about third person singular, remember we need to add the S in the third person singular, okay? So questions about simple present, guys? Questions? No questions? Everything good? No? No, Jennifer? No yet, don't worry. Okay, uh, guys, we have a speaking practice. We will get in pairs and we will tell your partner what is a regular day, like in your workplace, all right? We will use present, simple present to tell the activities, all right? You will go ahead and make like a kind of a schedule like that. What do you, what is your normal day in your workplace, okay? 
¿Cuál es su horario en su trabajo? Let's see, it is from 8 a.m. to 4 p.m. ¿Qué hace desde las 8 hasta las 4? ¿Cuál es su rutina de trabajo? La, las actividades que más se repiten. Vamos a explicarle eso a nuestro partner utilizando simple present. ¿Ok? For example, you can say, I arrive at work at 7.50. Then I start my test at 8 a.m. Um, and you continue, right? You continue saying the sentences in simple present. We will go ahead and practice orally, all right? Not written, but orally, all right? So here we have like a kind of a schedule of Thursday. What do you do um, in the morning and in the afternoon, okay? But this is like not in the workplace, but in your daily life, okay? But this is gonna be in your workplace. ¿Qué es lo que hace usted en su workplace? ¿Cuáles son las actividades que más se repiten? Sus actividades que son programadas, ¿sí? Vamos a discutir eso con su partner and we have 10 minutes to do it, all right? 10 Is minutes. Uh, mm -hmm. Excuse me. Uh, uh, and now I, I was reading about the topic. Um, under the start um, is a school a schedules schedules uh -huh. um, is 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 plan for 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 an, for an activity or event uh huh it's, yeah it's correct you you stand you stand me sorry could you please repeat it again um and uh, is is to the last is uh, como el significado de eso es 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 um uh, plan for for um, an activity or, or event exactly yes it's a, a special activity or un evento eh, programado sí yes, uh, uh -huh. i was writing in um and also a series of step to be to be carried mm -hmm. or, 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 or goals okay i didn't get the last part julio sorry goals oh your the goals meta. Goals, okay. uh, goals, meta. Uh -huh. uh, um, I, I, I am, I understop, understop. For goals, goals uh, uh -huh. Julio, I believe that we don't use the simple present. I know this uh, is a, a, a an activity. Uh -huh. you, you use, let's say, um, it is the I am going to a structure for goals. Cuando usted se está yes. proponiendo una meta, utiliza la estructura de I am going to. Oh, Pero okay, para yeah. esto es como, como más eventos programados, ¿verdad? Yes, yes, uh -huh. yes. Es que yo lo leí hoy en la... Ah, ahora, okay. hace ratitos. Entonces, eso es lo ah. que yo entendí. Entonces, eso es lo que quería comentar. Bueno, Julio, no se preocupe, pero thank you for asking, ok? Thank you. Continue okay. participating like that, please. <laughs> ok, so, guys, any other questions so far? Solamente tengo, how many listeners? Jaime, Luis, Jessica, who else is a listener today? Me, teacher, Jonathan, because I am going to start to running now. Ok, no worries. Ok, let me stop sharing for a bit. Thank and you. I already send it to you guys the um, the activity through WhatsApp group, okay? So you know you have it there. Let me make the breaker rooms so we will work on that, okay? Allow me just a moment. Any other question, guys? Okay, I am making the breakout rooms right now. 
let's see. Okay, guys, click and join, please. I already assigned to you to some uh, breaker rooms. Click on join guys, please. Can you click and join please? Hello, Kenny, click and join. He has a, a problem or, or anything um a second um i write reports about the past day um and then uh, yes, sir, you for me you please okay um i work from monday to Friday, I arrived to my work at 7.40 a.m. and prepare my coffee at 8 a.m. and <laughs> take my lunch from 12 a.m. to 1 p.m. And yes, so guess that. Repairs, I'll go see repairs. Okay. Repairs. So, um, repairs for me is a uh, um. Uh, uh, engineers, uh, at UCA, and is. I receive a message or or document uh, to give them in the work. Um, I prepare document like um, <clears throat> I. <laughs> okay. I'm for years. Oh, uh, I worked at Proesa. Um, is the is is the government? Uh, okay, that's the government. Yes. Uh, really? Yes. Okay. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. Nice, nice to meet Stephanie. you too. <laughs> okay, tell me about you, Angela Stephanie. And Estefania Marroquí, and I, I 20, 29 years old, and I work uh, as secretary in a, a government institute. Inst ¿Cómo se dice? Eh, de gobierno. 
gobierno. En, una, insti en una institución de gobierno. Sí, government institute. Ah, the government is. Institute. That's okay, excellent. Nice to meet you, Angela Stefania. Nice uh, to meet you. What do you prefer? Like, what do you prefer that I can say? It? Angela Stefania, Stefania, Marroquín. Estefanía. <laughs> okay. What about you, Marina? <laughs> Marina or Vanessa or Miss Vasquez? Eh, both, both. both. Eh, Marina Marina. And Vanessa. It's it's okay. Okay, thank you. And you, okay. Daniel. Uh, yes, I give you uh, my presentation about myself. Okay. I talk a little bit about myself. Okay, my name is Daniel Arquibles Florentino. I live in Soyapango and working in Jongwon International in Zona Franca Internacional in a way of aeropuerto. Are others activities um, in the house? If I not have other about. Te lo hace digital, Bea. Yes. It's a... In the computer. Uh... Um... Cerca. Near. Near. Este. Cerca. Near. Near. Um, I. 10 p.m. And I. I share. Busco. I share. Uh, pupusería. Ah. Yes. Um, uh, I take. I take a break. Take a, a, a break um, at 10 p.m. Break. Yes, um, mm -hmm. um, 30 minutes. Minute. <gasps> yes. It's amazing. Uh, I can do yes. it. <laughs> I, I, eat, I eat fast. Come on, rápido. <laughs> you fast. <laughs> Yes. Have it. I don't have it this time. This time. Yes. <laughs> yes. Time. Um. Uh. Pupusa with chocolate. Or oh, rice. 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 Cool. Juice. Yes. Um. Juice. Uh, yes. Um. Leather. Leather. Um. And uh, the new new start. Of my. I. Read the emails um, I read the I read the email I no write perdón write the email uh, sometimes meet meet with with my partner compañeros yes partner a co-worker. Co-worker. Um, this is my... Uh, regular day. Yes. Your regular day. That's okay. Excellent. You are, you are very sociable. 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 I don't know how they say sociable. But yes. <laughs> and that's okay. Uh, Tell me about you, Angela. What is your regular regular day like in your workplace using the same presence and i start to work at uh, 7 a.m and i receive documents and and always on i always answer the phone and i attend visit and sometimes I archive documents. Mm -hmm. Yes, preparing my class for, for after day. 
and prepare, preparing my, um, how do you say, uniform? Uniform? Uniform. Yes, thank you, yes. Fatima. <laughs> And um, other activities in my house, and I I forget <laughs> my work in my house, and in the afternoon. And you. I know them, uh, the plants and uh, that near of the terminal. No, it's, it's, uh, it's so it's far, far away. Far away. Okay. Uh, them, yes, I, I, I know. I know a little it's Santo near, Tomas. Little. No, the young one is nearby to Loquita. Nearby. More, more of it. It's, it's nearby to it, uh, it for. Sorry? Paper. Um, um, pencil, pen, um, uh, sword, products um, in the a little stores, just the consumer, the, the consumer. daily consumer. Consumer daily, yes, yes. Um, uh, I recently finished finished uh, finished my my work, um, um, before before eight p.m. Hace poquito acabo de terminar. Very late. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's uh, very late. Uh, yes, and uh, I am. I am uh, one person um, meticuloso. Eso no lo sé. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like it. I like I like it. Uh -huh. uh, my body is is perfect. Ah, do you like? Do yes, you like uh, your work? Nice. Yes, uh, my light, uh, este, my, no, excuse me, um, I like and um, my word is sin errores. Mm -hmm. oh, without yes. mistakes. Yes, without no, mis no, mistakes. no, I no, teacher, no, like teacher no, mistakes. Teacher no, 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 Yes, meticulous. Yes, meticulous. Yes. Meticulous. Yes. Um. Well, all very difficult. Yes. <laughs> is 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 they? Hello, hello. Thank you for joining back. How was the practice, guys? How was it? Was it good? Did you practice a lot with your classmate? Guys? How was it? Did you practice? 
Yes, no, maybe. More, more or less. More or less. Mm -hmm. I listened to you. I listened to all of you guys and you did an amazing job. Yes. You know what, what caused my attention and, uh, and, and something that I feel proud of uh, is that you keep all the conversations in uh, English. So congratulations, guys. You're Thank doing you. great, okay? That's yes. the purpose, to keep it in English, all right? That's the I purpose. Love, I love you. I love you, healthy person. Yeah. <laughs> always, always. And remember, if the other person is start speaking in Spanish, you continue speaking in English. <laughs> I mean, uh, even is, though the other person is speaking in Spanish, is, you continue. <laughs> but it's necessary to, Spanish, to, yes. to, to uh, clarify what is the main idea with another person with are you talking uh, when it's necessary to have a, a little bit presentation because I don't know what is my new classmates. For yes. me, it's all our new classmates for me. <laughs> really? Yes. Okay, I, I really only love us, this. Only, only, only us thing is my co-worker and his classmate too. <laughs> but I really okay. love that activity, Daniel. Uh, thank you very much because uh, Daniel was introducing um, his, uh, himself uh, with his classmates. I really love that because in that way, you can go ahead and create that rapport between you. So you will feel comfortable with your classmates. So very good, Daniel. I really like it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because when you are really talking, it's necessary to be free. It's necessary to be free and clarify, be relaxed, be To rate the happy. eyes, right? It's necessary to break the eyes. That's right. All right. Perfect, guys. So I want to say something, guys. Uh, you're doing awesome, okay? I don't want you to feel uh, bad if sometimes uh, you feel um, that you don't know, that it's difficult for you, that the other person the other other person is is talking more than you i don't want you feel frustrated or i don't want you to feel uh, with no motivation okay just allow me one second um reinicie su inter Sorry, guys. Um, it is because Julio is having problems with the internet connection. Okay. So, um, yes, as I was mentioning, um, yes, I don't want, I don't want that happens, guys because you're doing awesome, okay? So remember that you're doing what you can and you're doing the best, all right? So let's continue, let's keep it up like that. Don't hesitate to ask me questions in case you need, or, but I don't want you to feel with no motivation in this class. I know you can do it, all right? So let's continue. Don't miss classes, pay attention, make the, make the um, homework assignments, participate guys, okay? Because you're awesome and you will do it, okay? We will continue with more and more courses, okay? So don't give up, don't give up, all right? That's very important. So this is what I wanted to mention before to continue and let's see. Okay, all right. So let me continue sharing the screen right now. Here we have it. All right. So guys, uh, now that we have, uh, we got uh, more practice about the simple present as for schedule activities, we will continue talking about simple present. Um, let's go to the page number 21. All right, in your course book, page 21 in your course book, I believe is 21 is this. Okay, we have a conversation here. 
all right? But before going to this conversation, I want to ask you some questions, guys. And those are the questions that, that I want to ask you. Okay, I don't know if you are working in a restaurant. If you don't, if you're not working in a restaurant, let's suppose that you work in a restaurant, okay? Because you never know. I mean, we never know, guys. What about if tomorrow we need to go to a restaurant and, and we need to work there or we need to help someone to, um, you know, to assist people in the restaurant, all right? We never know. So I would like to ask you guys, what is an important strategy? Uh, what is an important strategy restaurant could implement to get more clients? What do you think? That what will be one of the most important strategy that the restaurants could implement to get more clients, guys? Let's think about this. What do you think about? Uh-huh. Could you please give me maybe one, two strategies about uh, any restaurant that can implement in order to get more clients? Teacher low price and good treatment. Good job, Jennifer. Low price, yes, and good treatment, right? Good customer service, right? Good treatment, yes, that is. That is actually something that we need to have, customer service, right? And good price, love price, low price, right? What else, guys? What else do you think? Thank you, Jennifer. What else do you think that we need to implement? Be, be clean and uh, have different menus. Yes, that is essential, right? Because they when I to go to the clean. restaurants, I see that I, the, the, the restaurant is clean, that mm -hmm. is okay for me. It is like uh, that, right? I check the menu, um, but for me, it's okay. Yes. It's like, <laughs> mm. <laughs> they, this, I check. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's mm. clean. <laughs> and Sorry, also, guys, the smell, right? I don't know. I love the smells in the places. <laughs> I don't know why, but it should have a good smell. <laughs> I mean, I'm crazy, but okay, <laughs> very good. And it's to be clean. Definitely, they need to be clean, right? And also, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Please remind me the other one you said, Daniel. Good, good decoration. Which one you said? Good decoration in the place. Oh, yes, a good decoration. I, I'm going to be saying something regarding this, Lisa. Just allow me one second. Daniel, remind me the other one, please. Ah, you say that's, I say that's a different, have different oh, menus. Different menus, right? Yes. That is for people, based, vegetable person, or for exactly. the other one. Begins, right? Be begins. begins. Yes. Uh huh. I don't remember exactly the pronunciation of this. I believe it's that. Vegan. Let me see. Vegetarian. I don't know. Uh huh. But there. Like this. Uh -huh. it's, it's like this. <laughs> Give me vegan. a second, because um, yes, exactly. I believe it's vegan. One second. Let me make sure. Uh huh. Let me see. Vegan, right? Vegan person. Whenever we're talking about vegan person, yes, vegan, vegano, vegan, vegan person. Okay, very good. So yes, it needs to have a um, variety, right, of dishes. Variety of dishes. Very good. Good point. Lisette, thank you. Good decoration. Yes. Um, I follow one of the. I don't know who's that person. I don't. I mean, I, I know obviously her name, but it's someone that that I learned in my marketing classes last year. I remember my teacher told us about that person. That person gave us advices about how to get uh, more clients, right? In your, in your, uh, I mean, in your business, etc. All right. So this person uh, applauded a story 
and that person uploaded a story about one restaurant. And it was not a restaurant, sorry, it was a cafe. And the cafe was famous because of the decoration. And there were many people who attended to this cafe, I mean, who go to this cafe just because of the decoration, because they wanted to take pictures. They had like a telephone. I don't know how, how do you call those, the street telephones? No sé si han visto esos teléfonos de unos rojitos que hay, que habían antes, o I don't know, que algunos lugares hay. Unos que, que no sé si alguien, uh, si ustedes han ido, imagino que sí, a Guatemala, a, a Paseo Cayala, hay un teléfono de esos que también re, se recuerda a los que hay en Europa. Unos rojos que están en la oh, calle. Sorry? How do you call it? ¿Cómo le llaman? The Osefrim, the resort, que se marca con el dedo. Ajá, así. ok, sí. ajá, de esos. Vaya, pero ustedes saben de que de esos pues no hay, ¿verdad? Me imagino que en unos países sí, pero we don't have them. Y a veces, ok, lo que quiero mencionarles es que en ese, en ese café que ella dijo, hay un teléfono de esos y había una decoración lindísima de flores. Entonces, solamente por ese spot que tenía el, el café, solamente por eso, eso, guys, atraía muchos clientes en el café. Entonces, lo que dijo Lisette, a veces, guys, solamente uno va solamente por la decoración del lugar, porque se quiere tomar fotos, ya ve, a veces uno como en, ¿verdad? Pero, ok, I just wanted to bring that point, which I believe that sometimes you might say, Mm, but teacher, you know what? No, good decoration, guys. I don't know why people go there whenever there is a good decoration. So very good. I wanted to mention this. Very good, they said. Very good, guys. Daniel, uh, Jennifer, good. So let me ask you another question. What are some successful restaurants you know? Could you please tell me some successful restaurant that you know? Successful restaurants? Uh, in my case, uh, I like so uh, picnic. Uh, if uh -huh. you know, picnic is a great place for take a coffee and go with your family and take a pictures and um, exactly. uh, eat uh, on different uh, eats. So I I know another place that uh, is in um, in the flowers root is in Sonsonate uh -huh. and that when you call uh, Acaltepec there are so many many places but I I remember that place for um, the decoration and 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 the difference as the um, it's for getting uh, when you Different are dishes, eating right? or tasting. Exactly. Yeah. Very good. Thank you. Yes, but okay, let me ask you a question. What do you think that picnic make? Uh, I mean, what do you think that picnic is doing in order to get uh, more clients or more customers? What do you think that they are doing? If you go to because picnic, you go. I mean, why do you go to picnic? Why, guys? I think I think for the decoration. And the, decoration. I, I can say tobogan. Tobogan. How can I? How can you say for tobogan? the attraction, they, right? For this attraction, they have, they have a they lot have of attractions. They, they always they always share the thematics for. Uh -huh, and exactly. when it's that, a Christmas, that's true, that's they true. change. When it's uh, spring, they change. When it's uh, the other season, they change. Exactly. Yes, they highlight all the seasons, right? All the seasons, all the holidays, they highlight all of them and they celebrate it and they, they put uh, decoration and all of this. I remember I, I went there. Um, 
but there were there was not the attraction that, that there are right now that there is right now i mean they didn't have the ace attraction and also they didn't have the the forest i mean the forest was not open the small forest right the small forest they didn't have opened the forest and i really like the i really like no yes i mean i really like food but it was like um, 70 percent right but um what i wanted to mention is that i don't know if uh, food is still good do you know if food is still good there no no the food good is is uh, uh, a little Sorry. expensive and... a big expensive i say <laughs> really expensive. Big expensive. Uh, yeah, yes, yes, of course, because it's hmm. a, a bit, a bit meat, a bit uh, train. It's, it's, it's not necessary to to pay uh, a lot of money for it. But I think, I don't know how do you say sobrevalorado. Yes, this almost, because you pay the, say? you pay how the. How do you say sobrevalorado, Miss Almos? Sorry, ah, uh, sobrevalorado. Yes, this restaurant is sobrevalorado. Sobrevalorado. Mm, let's see. We can say like over, overrated, overrated, sobreestimado, sobrevalorado, over, over. Overvalue, overrated, overvalue or overrated. Like this. Like this. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is so uh, over overvalue, I believe. Sobrevalorado, overvalue. Yes, okay. it's overvalue. Mm -hmm. um, but yes, um, I believe is that is right. Okay, what about guys? I have heard uh, actually one of my favorite ones because I really love, uh, I mean, I really love that dish. <laughs> I don't care about, this is something that I wanted to mention. I don't care about the place, but I love the dish. I mean, I love uh, wings, okay? So I love buffalo wings just because of that. I go there just because of the wings. No, it's not the wings that, they are the chunks, right? Or oh, ruin? No. They have chunks and wings. Uh huh. It is a. It's just about the chunks. I got there just because of the chunks. That's it. I don't care about anything else. I just want. I just go there, or I even ask for delivery whenever I can. That's it. <laughs> I don't care about the restaurant. So just in mind. There is always something that, that is calling your, um, a customer's attention, right? And also, I believe that they have many promotions, right? I don't know. I don't care. I just, I just care about that. <laughs> but okay, there are many restaurants, guys, all right, that they are successful in El Salvador because of this. Um, also, there is another one that I, ha I heard Los hermanos, how do you call tacos hermanos? Yes, is it like that? Tacos hermanos. In la Gran Vía. Ajá, así se llama, ¿verdad? Yes. Ahora tacos se hermanos. mucho de moda. I, I haven't gone there, no he ido, no sé, but they, they say they're good. All right. I think it's only marketing. Really? We, yes. Mm, I, I love know. Mexican, I love Mexican food and in other places is better, better. Really? I haven't gone there. But guys, Mexican food is not, I mean, it's, it's, not, it's not actually the one that we have here in El Salvador, right? But okay. <laughs> we have it like a Mexican food. Okay, guys, thank you very much for discussing this. I believe this is an interesting topic. And we, if we start talking about restaurant, if we start talking about how to get, a, I mean, customers happy and all of this, wow, there is a bunch of topics to talk about, right? So uh, we have a conversation here. And this conversation is this, okay? 
For this conversation, I want to hear you to practice this conversation, okay? I just, I just, uh, I will just read it once for you to listen the pronunciation and later on you will practice it in pairs here, okay? So let's start practicing if you want. I'm going to go through the attendance because it's almost nine. And while I am uh, passing the tendencies, please let's start practicing or let's start understanding the conversation. Okay, and later on we will practice. So today is Wednesday the 22nd, Angela Estefania Marroquín Martinez. Angela Estefania, we couldn't hear you. I hear teaching. Oh, great, okay. Uh, Cristian Jose Lopez Perez. What is Cristian? Daniel Arquimedes Florentino Garcia. I'm here, teacher. Great, thank you. Present. Daniel Ezequiel Alvarez Mejia. Present, teacher. Great. Estela Mabel Orellana del Cid. Present, teacher. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortes. Present, teacher. Thank you. Jennifer Noemi Mata Aragón. Present, teacher. Jessica del Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Jonathan Alexi González Torres. Present teacher. Julio César Merino González. Present. Thank you. Julio César Ramírez Arevalo. Present teacher. Great. ¿Todo bien, Julio? Sí, teacher. Todo bien ahorita. Ok, perfect. Me avisa cualquier cosa. Kenny Lizette Cuellar de Barrientos. Present. Thank you. Linda Magali García Montoya. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Present teacher. Marcos Amil Carmancía Gutiérrez. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Present teacher. I am here. Thank you. Just one moment, guys. Give me just one moment, sorry. Okay, sorry. Um, Marielo Janet Cornejo Erazo. Marielos. Marina Vanessa Vázquez Romero. Present teacher. Osvin Alexis Flores Hernández. Present teacher. Sabrina Lisset Orellana García Orellana. Present teacher. Sabrina. Good evening, I'm here. Good evening. Sorry. Lisset del Carmen Hernández Miss Me. Present. Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present teacher. Great. Perfect, guys. Okay. So, thank you very much. And let's go ahead and practice this conversation i will read it listen to the uh, to the pronunciation and then you will do it okay okay it says uh mr mott uh, that's a conversation between mr mott and jennifer hello jennifer how is it going just fine mr mott i am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis that sounds good look I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir, how often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting 
a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir, we never do. Mm. And we are like, mm. <laughs> okay, so uh, let's see. I would like just to go ahead and, and just uh, repeat some uh, pronunciation of some words with you. And then you repeat it with me. Just allow me one moment. And we will do it together. So you, you learn about the pronunciation, okay? Okay, let's see. Hmm. Mm. Regular basis. Regular basis. Repeat after me, guys. Regular basis. Regular basis. Regular basis. Regular basis. New marketing strategies. New, New marketing, marketing strategies. 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 Very good. Strategies. Strategies. Promoting dessert, 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 promotional item, promotional item, 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 item. Very good. Okay, so guys, I will go ahead and ask you to practice this conversation. Okay, um, I will ask right now, let's see, Jennifer. Jennifer will be, nah, let's see, Jennifer. <laughs> Jennifer will be Jennifer. <laughs> and then Mr. Mott will be um, Oswin, okay? Mr. Mott, you start okay. and Jennifer will be Jennifer. <laughs> okay, I'm Jennifer. Yes. Okay. Hello, Jennifer. <coughs> How are you doing? Just fine, Mr. Mott. I am just checking the number of people who come on a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing. Tracy, I'm sorry, teacher. <laughs> Stray. Teacher, could you... Sorry, uh, um, yes, strategies. Strategies? Extra? Strategies. Strategies. There you and go. And I young want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often do you change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting, promoting. Teacher, help me. Promoting. Promoting. Mm -hmm. Promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Good job. A round of applause for you guys. Very good. Um, let's go ahead and just check the pronunciation of some words. Uh, let me just a moment. Where is it? Okay, so how how is it going? Repeat after me, guys. How is it going? How is it going? How is it going? How is it going? going? Um, strategies. Strategies. Some things. Some things. Some things. Some things. Something. Vamos a ver esta comparación, miren. Vaya, vamos a ver esta. Some things. Something. Something. 
Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Something. Good job. Perfect. Now, um, let's see. Soldon. 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 Promoting. Promoting. Dessert. Teacher, please. Oh, promoting. Yeah. Promoting. 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 Dessert. 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 El otro de desierto es dessert. Es, this is dessert. Ok. Lleva dessert. por acá como la mayor fuerza de voz. ¿eh? Dessert. Y el otro dessert. de desierto va al principio en la mayor fuerza de voz. Dessert. Este es dessert. Que dessert. es postrecito, right? <ríe> Los postrecitos. The postre, ok. Dessert. Um, let's see. Item. Oh, that, that was good, but okay, repeat. Item. Item. Good job. Perfect. Okay, Marcos Antonio and Daniel Arquímedes. Okay, Daniel, uh, Marcos Antonio, you are Mr. Mott. Okay, and Daniel, you are Jennifer. Okay, let's start. Okay. Okay. Hello, Jennifer. Who is the going? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry to interrupt you. Hagámoslo personalizado. Hello, Daniel. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Melgar. Okay? Okay, yeah. Hello, ¿quién era? Story again. Story again, Marcos Antonio. Story again, Marcos. Mr. Melgar, story again. ¿Cómo era el nombre de él? You can see it right now. Daniel. Daniel. Okay. Hello, Daniel. How is it going? Just fine, Mr. Melgar. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. Uh, that's so good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategic and um, i i want to know something tell me sir how often do we change the menu well we seldom change the menu however we are promoting a dessert every week Do we ever give a promotion item? No, sir. We never do. Okay, very good. A round of applause for you guys. Okay, uh, let's repeat after me. Sounds. 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 That sounds good. Repeat it. That sounds, sounds good. good. Strategies. <clears throat> strategies. Strategies. strategies um change 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 change, change. change. very good um promotional. promotional promotional good job very good guys okay let's go with mabel and Daniel Ezekiel. Mabel, you start. And Daniel Ezekiel, you go next. You personalize it, okay? You use your names instead of Mr. Mott and Jennifer. Okay, teacher. Hello, Daniel. How is it going? Just fine, Miss Mabel. I'm just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's so good. I'm sorry. <laughs> that sounds good. Look, I'm thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know something. 
Tell me means. How often do you change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dis dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, miss, we never do. Very good. All right, guys. Very good. I run applause for you. Let's repeat after me. Strategies. 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 Item. 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 Very good. Item. Uh, seldom. What? Oh, what is uh, the meaning? What is the pronunciation? Uh -huh. oh, seldom. Is seldom. 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 Ah, okay. Seldom. Jonathan, seldom. are you are you ready or you're still? Jonathan. Okay, Julio Cesar and Angela Estefania. Julio Cesar, you start and Angela Estefania go next. Are you there, guys? Julio, Julio Cesar, Cesar Arevalo. Merino. I'm ah, here with okay. you. Julio Cesar Ramirez Arevalo. Me here, teacher. Jonathan, sorry. Okay, you go next, Jonathan. Don't worry. Julio Cesar Ramirez and Angela Estefania, okay. are you there? Yes, teacher. Julio Cesar Ramirez? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. So, Julio Cesar, you start. Okay, Julio, you start. Remember to personalize the names, okay? Estefania and, and Julio. Okay, let's do it, guys. Hello, Miss Marroquin. How is the going? Just fine, Mr. Ramirez. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional iron? No, sir, we never do. Very good, good job. I have just one word for you and it's strategies, okay? Repeat after me guys, strategies. Strategies. Good job. Thank you, Julio. Thank you, Stefania, wonderful. Okay, Jonathan and Julio Cesar Merino, okay? You start, Jonathan. Oh my God. Okay, okay, okay. Um, hello, Julio Cesar, how it's going? And um, you find uh, Mr. How it's gone? Sorry, Jonathan. Yes, and um, I am just Jonathan. checking. Jonathan, you find Mr. Jonathan. I am just checking the number of, of people who become a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies, and I want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often do you do we change the menu? Well, um, we seldom change 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 uh, the menu. Uh, whatever we are we are promoting promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional items? Items, sorry. No, sure. We never do. Okay, thank you. Very good. You. Great job, guys. Okay, let's repeat after me. Uh, some things. Repeat some after. Time. 
Repeat after me, menu. 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 Very good. Menu. However, however. 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 Dessert. Week. 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 Sir. 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 No, sir. 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 No, good sir. Job. Very good, guys. Okay, let's go with. Bari, Marina Vanessa, Marina Vanessa. Yes, teacher. Very good, Marina Vanessa and Fatima Denise. You start, Marina. Uh, with with Fatima, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, hello, Fatima. How it's going? Just fine, Mister Vanessa. I am just checking the number of people who come in a regular basis. That's so good. Look, I am thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know something. Tell me, sir. How often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? No, sir. We never do. Very good. Good job. Okay. Guys, I just want to um, help you with this word again. Strategies, guys. I know it's difficult, don't worry, but let's repeat it. Strategies. 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 Very good. Y cuando le respondamos en caso que sea una mujer, usted le puede decir miss, okay, miss. O le puede decir si quiere ma'am, okay. Eso es como señora. Señora, como en vez de, de señor, usted está diciendo señora, pero es para mujer. Ma'am, ok. Tell me, ma'am. Tell me, ma'am. Ok. Tell me, ma'am. Repeat after me. Ma'am. 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 Thank you, ma'am. Ok. Thank you, ma'am. It's like señora, right? Pero tengan cuidado porque también es como señora. Entonces, si quiere decir señorita, le puede decir miss. Thank you, miss. So tell me miss, all right? O si no le dicen su nombre, all right? So, let's see. Let's go with Sabrina. Sabrina and... Hmm, who's missing? Oh my God. Uy, se me pierde usted. Lo, lo su, subo y bajo y... Um, Ezekiel, Ezekiel, <laughs> Ezekiel, you star, okay, and then Sabrina. Uh, uh, it's the second time, don't worry about it. Ah, so Ezekiel, okay, <laughs> sorry, and this is Sabrina and Lisette. It's the second time, but teacher, I will do it, okay? <laughs> yes, no, 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 it's fine. Thank you, Ezekiel. Sabrina and Lisette, Lisette, are you there? Si no nos ayuda, Ezekiel, no worries. Lisette, yes, Lisette. I'm here. Okay, so <laughs> you start, Sabrina, and then Lisette. Okay. Uh, hello, Lisette. How is it going? Just fine, Miss Sabrina. I'm just checking the number of the people who come in a regular basis. That sounds good. Look, I'm thinking about new marketing strategies and I want to know some things. Tell me, Miss. How, how often do we change the menu? Well, we seldom change the menu. However, we are promoting a dessert every week. Do we ever give a promotional item? 
No, miss, we never do. Thank you, girls. Very good. Okay, just repeat after me. Seldom. 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 Promoting. 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 Very good. Guys, les voy a mandar ahorita una imagen. Ya se los había mandado los demás, pero for the ones that don't have it, les voy a mandar ahorita esta imagen que ustedes lo pueden utilizar. Miren, ahí está eh, Mr. Es para señor. Ok, doesn't tell us the marital, the marital status. Usted puede ocupar el Mr. si es señor o es joven, lo que sea, pero lo puede ocupar. Luego tenemos el Mrs. Eh, arriba está cómo se, se puede poner de... Let's see. Sorry. Arriba está cómo usted lo puede poner. Ok, la M, la R y la S. Mrs. Usted dice, por ejemplo, Mrs. Miller. Ok, acuérdense que cada vez que utilicen estos guys acrónimos, ustedes van a utilizar el last name de la persona. Ok, last name, el apellido. Refers to a married woman. Ok, tengan cuidado aquí. Ok, porque si usted le dice Mrs. a alguien, le está diciendo que está casada. O so, tiene que saber si está casada, si no, no lo ocupe. Si no, mejor ocupe el Miss, Miss, que está de último. En tercero tenemos el Miss, que es para una persona que no se ha casado. Ok, Miss. Miss Smith. Miss Smith, ajá, Miss Jones, por ejemplo. Y el último sí se utiliza para una persona que si quiere, usted no sabe si está casada o qué, acompañada, o no, soltera, pero ok, usted puede decir Miss. Esa es la pronunciación, Miss, ok. So, repeat after me, number one, Mister. Mister. Second one, Mrs. No sé si están viendo la imagen igual que yo, guys. Mrs. Yes, ok. Mrs. La tercera es Miss. 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 Con S. Miss. Y la última es con Z, vibración. Miss. 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 ¿Te fijan la gran diferencia, verdad? Si ustedes dicen Miss, persona que no se ha casado. Miss. Usted puede generalizar. Y el mister generalizado también. ¿Ok? Y el otro que les enseñé de mem. Mem. Ese se ocupa bastante también. Ok. Questions about this or no questions, guys? Kenny, are you here? Would you like to participate? Creo que solo Kenny me hacía falta, right? Miss Smith, like the... the, the like the... The partner here. ¿Hm? I don't know. <laughs> Como el apellido de una compañera aquí, no sé. <laughs> ah, me. ok. Yes. No Solo sé qué se me hizo, Kenny. Ok, well, guys. We finish then with this exercise. And I would like to ask you guys. What kind of restaurant do you think Jennifer manages? Mm -hmm. A bake, bake store. Is that a bake? What is it, guys? A cupcake star. <laughs> they are having, they isn't have a menu, have a menu. I think it could be a restaurant. Normal restaurant? A small restaurant. A small restaurant? Yes, I think. A coffee shop. A, co a, a cafe? A is cafe. that a cafe? Ajá, uh -huh. es like, like a café, right? Creo que es un café, más que todo. Because Colores. they offer a dessert. Every week, exactly. Very good. Yes, I believe it's a café. Mm -hmm. All right. What are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients, guys? What are some marketing strategies the restaurant is using nowadays to get more clients? Or they are promoting a dessert. They are promoting a dessert every week. Okay, perfect. Very good. 
Good job, guys. Okay, so let's see. Let me continue with this. All right, let's continue with this. Let me go back. And here we have the topic for today, for today's class, guys. And the topic for today's class, you already know it. This is just a review, but okay, wonderful review. So this review basically, okay. This review is about adverse of frequency, okay? Adverse, uh, those adverse of frequency tell us how, how often takes place, okay? Que, uh, how often, que, que fre, con que frecuencia pasa algo, okay? Por eso son adverse of frequency, con qué frecuencia pasa algo. Y se utilizan en presente, simple present, okay? So, we have, uh, um, let's see, nine, nine adverse of frequency. And here we have the, the, the adverse of frequency. We have always, usually, normally, generally, often, frequently, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, rarely, and never, okay? So it has a frequency percentage. For example, if I say always, that means that you always, siempre, okay, 100%, you do the things, okay? For example, you say, I always wake up at six o'clock. You always wake up at six o'clock, every single day. Siempre usted se levanta a las seis. Por eso es el 100% de frecuencia. Este es el, el con qué frecuencia lo hace. Si usted quiere decir que nunca lo hizo, entonces usted se va para el cero percentage, which is never. I never wake up at six o'clock, all right? Si usted dice, mm, sometimes, algunas veces es 50%. I sometimes play tennis on the weekend, all right? So, let's repeat after me. Always. 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 One second. Seldom. What means seldom? Seldom. It is Para, like. Uh -huh. Raramente. Raramente. Ajá, se parece a raramente. <laughs> Porque tenemos uno que es raramente, actually. Raramente. It's like a uh, almost. Almost never, no. Or oh, that, eso no existe. <laughs> sí, sí, sí. Almost never, sí. sí. Ah, ok. Casi nunca, casi, right? Casi. Ajá, el almost never es casi como rarely. Es, realmente es como raramente, ¿verdad? Pocas veces. Seldom, pocas veces. Para variar, ¿verdad? No porque Ay. es casi rarely. Como raramente. Pocas veces, digamos. Seldom, pocas veces. Uh -huh. Ok. When I see this triangle, I think, uh, ¿cómo voy a pensar en todas estas palabras de hacer una frase? No, se lo tiene que aprender. Ok. Uh -huh. Ajá. Uh, we can share this pic. I will, yeah, definitely. I will. Let me see. Deme un segundo, se los comparto ya para que no se me olvide, guys. Thank Le you. Take a look to this right now. Tomen, eh, revisen eso ahorita. Revisen el triangle. Léanlo, analícenlo, ok. Estudienlo mientras yo les mando la foto. Y si tienen preguntas, me dicen después. Solamente vamos a eh, explicarlo primero. Vamos a ver, where is it? Bye, guys. Ahí se los mandé. Ok. I already send it to you. Okay, let's continue then. All right, so we have always. Then we have usually. Repeat after me. Usually. 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 Usualmente, right? Usually. Normally. 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 Generally. 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 Okay, just to confirm, usually has a 90%. Okay, 90%. Normally has an 80%. Okay. <laughs> Generally and normally, same 80%. Okay. 
Often, often, repeat after me. Often, 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 often. Omita la T, aquí es una silence letter, often. ok? Often. Tenemos silence letters, guys, que son las los, los letras o las letras que no se pronuncian en las palabras. Por ejemplo, acá, often, no pronunciamos la T. Ok, often, 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 often. Mm -hmm. often. often. frequently. 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 Frequentemente, ¿verdad? Often, frecuentemente, is the same. 70%. Ok. Sometimes. 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 Very good. Miren, guys. Un clue para pronunciation. Cada vez que ustedes pronuncian la M, guys, siempre háganlo de esta manera. Mm, ok, mm, like with the closed mouth. Mm, sometime. Sometimes. Okay. Sometimes. Sometimes. Y eso, eso va a ser una gran diferencia que usted diga so, sometimes. Sometimes. <laughs> sometimes. ¿Se fijan qué sometimes. diferencia? Sometimes. Oh, very good. Feels different. Sometimes. Hay mucha diferencia. Uh -huh. Sometimes. Okay. Sometimes is 50%. Okay. Then we have occasion, occasionally. Repeat after me. Occasionally. 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 Thirty percent. Occasionally. Then we okay. have seldom, which is ten percent. Seldom. 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 Is seldom or is seldom? Seldom. 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 Rarely. 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 Mm -hmm. Rarely. 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 Mm -hmm. Rarely. Never. 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 Zero percent, right? Otra cosa, otro tip. Eh, la, esta V se va a pronunciar así. Ok. It's vibra vibration. Con vibration. Ok. It's never. Voy a poner after me. Never. 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 Okay. Never. Es muy diferente si yo oh, pronuncio la esta, mire, de boy. Esta no es boy, es boy. Boy. Okay. Boy, chico. Boy. 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 Never. 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 Así ve. Never. Never. No, no, no. Okay, <laughs> sorry that I stopped sharing. Quería hacer otra cosa, quería um, quitar todo, pero okay. Guys, acá tenemos los diferentes percentage and we have uh, those hours of frequency. Usted lo va a ocupar dependiendo de qué usted quiera decir, qué tan, con, qué, con qué tan frecuencia usted hace algo. ¿Ok? ¿Y cuál va a ser la pregunta? How often? ¿Ok? Esta es la pregunta. ¿Se, en, en, ¿se, ¿se recuerdan de esa pregunta? Guys? How often? Por ejemplo, yo le digo, guys, how often do you play uh, tennis? Never. I never, I never play, play tennis. tennis, right? Very good. Let's see how often. Let me, let me put the, the question here. How often do you... And then, question mark. How often do you? Okay, so let me ask you more questions, guys. How often do you go to a party? Every weekend. Wow, very good. <laughs> Every weekend. Wow. So you go, I sometimes, sometimes. go, sometimes, right? I sometimes go sometimes. to the party, to a party. All right. How often do you go to the beach, guys? Never. Why? Occasionally. Occasionally. Never. never. Okay. Rarely. 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 Uh-huh. 
All right. So, um, how often do you go to the cinema? Never. I never. Rar rarely. 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 Okay. Rarely. How often do you take showers? Always. We always take a shower. <laughs> Are you sure? We always take a shower. One, one day, two week. Once in a while. <laughs> Once in a blue moon. Once in a blue moon is an idiom. Once in a blue moon. Que es mm, una vez. ¿Cómo se dice en, en español? Es como un dicho. Cuando se muere un burro. <risa> Yo no me sí. sabía. Cada, en en, en la... español <risa> es un idiom. Sí. Yo no sabía ese mujer. <risa> How do you say burro? Burro. <risa> En inglés. Donkey. Donkey. Horse, donkey. When a donkey die. No, entonces usted dice once burro. in a while. Once in a while. while. Sorry, sorry. Once in a blue moon. Es el idioma en inglés. Once in a blue moon. Cada vez que la luna se pone azul, right? Once in a blue moon. Pero así es el idioma. Así como yo, it doesn't make sense cuando usted me dijo que no se muere un burro. No, sabía. no, pero hay uno que es en español, que se parece Once in a Blue Moon. Hay otro, ¿no? No, solo cuando se dice todo blue. Todo blue, pero no, dice. no, hombre, cuando usted casi no hace algo. ¿Sabes? Hay Allá otro. a las 500. Allá a las 500. And the 500. Cuando retumbe el mar. Cuando retumbe el mar, oh my God. Yeah, ¿Cuándo qué? Cuando retumbe el mar, yo lo he escuchado ese. Cuando retumbe el mar. Oiga, Marcos, ¿me había hablado Marcos de ahí? ¿Ya lo escuchamos? No. Pero ok, yes, guys. No sé ni por qué hablamos no, pero eso, me pero... Más cuando se muere un burro. <risa> So, ustedes, you take, a, you take a shower once in a blue moon, right? <laughs> no, I'm <Yeah>. just kidding. <coughs> Sorry. Um, okay. Ni sé por qué empezamos a hablar de esto. I lost my, 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 okay. I got it. All right. So, um, okay. Let's repeat after me, guys. We have some examples here. I always wake up at six o'clock. Repeat after me. I always, always wake up at, at six o'clock. I usually come home after work. Mm, I don't I believe you. I usually come home, 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 home after, after work. After work. After work. After work. Only the Fridays no. Mm -hmm. I, nor <laughs> I, I normally know. swim normally. after school. I, I normally swim, swim after, after school. After school. After school. After school. Cool. I often spend Christmas with friends. I often spend Christmas with friends. I sometimes play tennis on the weekend. I sometimes, I sometimes play, play tennis, on the weekend. tennis on the weekend. I occasionally eat Vietnamese food. I occasionally eat Vietnamese food. I seldom go to the library. I seldom go to the library. I rarely listen to the radio. I, I rarely, rarely listen, listen to, the radio. to the, radio. the radio. I never listen to rock music. I, I never, never listen, listen to, rock music. Music. to rock, music. rock music. I love rock music. <laughs> okay, guys, um, send me two sentences, okay? Two sentences. Que ustedes de verdad, eh, o sea, de su personal life, de, de, de ustedes, mándenme dos, dos eh, oraciones ocupando los frequency adverbs, el que usted desea utilizar. Two, 
¿ok? Basado en usted, to. Ok. Or you know what, you will give it to me, guys. Este, este course lo vamos a hacer más speaking, ¿ok? Spoken, spoken. Oh, my God, my camera, my camera. Ok, let's see. Vamos a ver. Voy diciendo los nombres y ustedes me ayudan a hacer un ejemplo, right? Así que piensen ya en su ejemplo. Pero uno más, uno más rebuscadito, ¿verdad? Como que no solo always, ni, 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 ni no solo always, ¿verdad? Vaya, vamos con Sabrina. Sabrina, tell me yours. An example. I sometimes... And go to no. I sometimes watch a movie. I sometimes watch a movie. Watch a movie. All right. Very good. What movie? Watch. B. Watch movies. Ah, I sometimes. <laughs> I sometimes watch movies. Mm -hmm. Very good, Sabrina. Choose another person. Because I don't want to be, uh, I don't want to feel that. I don't want to feel that I'm choosing you. Okay. Uh, uh, Jessica del Carmen. Jessica is a listener today. Uh, Marina Vanessa. Marina, give me your example, Marina. In my example, I usually visit my mom on weekend. Great, perfect. Marina, she's another person. Uh, Daniel Ezekiel. Ezekiel, go for your example. Go with your example. I'm prepared. You're prepared. Uh, <laughs> um, I don't know. I occasionally uh, go to the park. Very good. To, to skateboard. Really? To practice a skateboard? To practice skateboard, yes. Wow. To cafe talon. Okay, good job. Perfect. I yeah. like this part. <laughs> Very good. I see Kels, she's another person. Um, Osbin. Osbin. I like this, this name, Osbin. Yes, I, um, I usually go to my job on bus. Very good. By bus. By bus. By bus. I Very rarely good. listen. Uh -huh. I rarely listen to the uh, music. Okay. You rarely listen to music. Very good. Great, Osbin. Choose another person, please. Um, Sabrina. Sabrina. I can say another. <laughs> yeah, do it. Yes. Well, well, um, I always and always be open. <laughs> I sell them and play soccer. Very good. Good job, Sabrina. Just another person. And Marcos Antonio. Marcos Antonio Melgar Perez. Mr. Perez, yeah. go for it. I always, always, always listen to radio in my job all day. Okay, great. Interesting. Very good, Marcos. Yeah. Choose another person. Always, always, yeah. always. Okay. Always. Yes, always. La superestrella. Yeah. 94. <laughs> that... Superestrella, no. Sure. La superestrella is the best radio. <laughs> it, it's, it's a good radio. Oh uh, my God, I don't know what you're talking yes, about. Okay. Yes, that is the radio. Bueno, it says that in is the radio of the pretty woman. Es la radio de la mujer bonita. Really? <laughs> es, 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 ¿Verdad que ese es el, el eslogan de la, de la 94 that first? Really? That, sí, yes, yes. I will listen to the 94, 94, 94.1. Yes. Oh, okay, okay. It has a really good program. I will listen to that. <laughs> okay, oh. Marcos, just another person. Uh, 
Your the other person is a Christian. No. Who? Christian? Christian? Christian is not here. No here. Because it's uh, Teacher's Day. He's celebrating. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I don't know. <laughs> Mr. Jaime too. Jaime is celebrating as well. <laughs> well no, I'm Mr. Jaime is busy right now. They are in the party. They are in the party. I'm a teacher and I'm oh, here. <laughs> Jennifer will do it. Yes, Jennifer. Okay, um, Jennifer. <laughs> okay, Jennifer. <laughs> Okay. I occasionally watch a series on, on Netflix. What series? Um, <laughs> Which one? Breaking Bad. All people recommend that which, series to me, but which, I haven't which watched one? it. Which one? Which one? Breaking Bad. No, I haven't seen do, do you like Friends? It's very good. And my second sentence sentence is I readily wear red lipstick. Okay, very good sentences. Thank you, Jennifer. Could you please choose another person? Okay. Lisette. Is Lisette? Okay, Lisette. Okay, um, I always make a uh, intermittent fasting. Okay. Okay, very good. Lisa, choose another person, please. Teacher and you. Mm. I have the teacher. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Teacher. Um, Marina. I will do it later. Marina, go for it. Marina, um, I am. <laughs> uh, I rarely um, no, I am I, uh, I occasionally go to the cinema. Very good. Great. Perfect, Vanina. Well, another person? <laughs> <laughs> Jonathan, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I rarely um, say that I uh, don't like cinema. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Jonathan, choose another person. Uh, let me see. Um, Teacher, um, almost. <laughs> teacher, you make me, uh, make people, me afraid. People want teacher saying us. I why? <laughs> with, with that kind of voice. <laughs> <laughs> Mira, escuchen, Marcos. Hmm? Okay. And, uh, and it is dark here. It's dark here because everybody is sleeping in your voice, you know. No, <laughs> and no, it's dark, teacher, right? Teacher, my, 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 yes. My, my, Fátima teacher. Denise. Fátima, okay, Fátima. Because teacher don't want to talk about. <laughs> no, I can. I can. I frequently, right. guys, right. don't okay, criticize me, but I frequently take a nap in the afternoon because I work late and I uh, I wake up very early, so I, I don't sleep good every day. I sleep like five hours, so that's why I usually take a snap. Uh, I usually take naps in the afternoon. Thank wow. you. Thank you. <laughs> Fatima, wow, go for it. <laughs> I rarely uh, watch Netflix. Okay, great, interesting. Choose another one, Fatima, another person. Um, Mabel. Mabel, okay. Okay. 
I rarely um, watch TV. Okay. I don't have that. I don't have either. I don't have a TV. <laughs> okay. I give it to my father. I gave it to my father. And I feel sad because I miss it. <laughs> but I don't have. Okay, continue, Mabel. <laughs> Choose another person. Um, Marcos Antonio? He already passed. Yeah. <laughs> um, Julio Cesar. Uh, Julio Cesar and Julio Cesar are missing. Daniel, are, Daniel is missing as well. Amilka, no. Amilka is not here. Amilka, no, no, is here. Daniel? Daniel, yes. Daniel, go for it. Why me? Kenny is missing. <laughs> okay. I rarely go to the church when I feel a little bit sad. Okay, thank you, Daniel. Choose another person. Um, okay. I, I, I don't know what. Julio and Julio and Kenny. Julio Cesar and Julio Cesar and Kenny are missing. Kenny. 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 Okay, it's less difficult, right? <laughs> um. um... Example for the adverb, adverb of frequent. Yeah. Okay. Um, I usually play soccer twice a week. Okay, very good. Choose uh, another person, Julio Cesar. Julio Cesar Merino. Okay, Julio Cesar Merino, go for it. <laughs> Thank you, Kenny. Uh, normally, later. Very good, great. Julio Cesar Ramirez. <laughs> I always go running on Sunday. Okay, perfect. Very good, guys. You did an amazing job, okay? So, guys, um, questions about adverse of frequency? No questions? No okay. Teacher. Go to the page 22, guys. Page 22, please. Page 22. And in the page 22, we have uh, the adverse of frequency that you already know that indicates how often an action takes place. Here we have less, and actually, we have hardly ever. Miren, tenemos el hardly ever. Um, ese es como raramente. Hardly ever. Es como el raramente, guys. El hardly ever. Pero los demás. Yo lo que hice es traer la más frequency of hours, pero hardly ever también no tenemos, ¿ok? En hardly ever entraría acá, miren. Hardly ever, ya les digo. Hardly ever sería antes del 5. Hardly ever, ¿ok? Por, como es casi igual que el seldom, después de seldom, en medio de seldom y rarely is hardly ever. Ok. Let me get a second, just. Um, quiero pasar la lista, guys, pero give me a second. Le voy a mandar este hardly ever por si le sale en los ejercicios. I hardly ever. Okay. Ajá. Es, se parece mucho a rarely, okay? Rarely. Le voy a mandar una captura, guys. Hardly ever. Es como a rarely, okay? Se lo voy a pasar ahorita para que lo tengan también. Por si el caso ustedes necesitan saber sobre hardly ever. Se lo vamos a adicionar acá a las que les mandé, okay? Bye, y se los mandé, guys. Hardly ever es como el rarely, ¿ok? Ahí se los mandé, ¿ok? It has five uh, percentage. Five percentage es como el otro seldom. Es como rarely, sorry. Hardly ever. Ok, so now go to the page 22. 
go to the page 22. All right, let's continue with this. So we have some examples. We often change the menu. We always give away promotional items and they regularly select the new options, okay? Now guys, let's go ahead and write sentences about the activities you do at your workplace. Use the following adverbs or frequency to say how often you do those activities. Okay, think about your workplace, el lugar de trabajo. Piensa acerca de las actividades you do there. How often do you do those activities? Busquen una actividad que, que combine con always, una con rarely, con hardly ever, que es la misma que rarely casi, seldom, sometimes, and never, okay? Busquen una actividad que hacen en su workplace y lo ponen acá como una oración, como una sentence. All right? Let's do this from the time that is missing. Using the time that is missing, we have six minutes to do it. Okay? We will do it right now. And I am going through the attendance list while you are doing so. Okay? Si tienen preguntas, me avisan, guys. Questions? No questions? Okay, I will go through the attendance list. And guys, let me see. Jennifer Noemi Mata, could you stay with me today in the 101 session, in the session de 101? Okay. Exactly. Okay. Ahora le tocaba. <laughs> <laughs> okay, very good. Okay, thank you. Okay, guys, let me go through the attendance list. Angela Estefania Marroquín Martinez. Present teacher. Cristian Josué López Pérez. Daniel Arquímedes Florentino García. Present teacher. Daniel Isiquiel Álvarez Mejía. Present teacher. Estela Mabel Orellana del Cid. Present teacher. Jaime Antonio Velar Cortés. Present teacher. Uh, Jennifer Noemi Mata Aragón. Present. Jessica Al Carmen Vázquez Vázquez. Present. Thank you. Jonathan Alexis Gonzalez Torres. Present teacher, I'm here. Great. Julio Cesar Merino Gonzalez. Present. Julio Cesar Ramirez Arevalo. Present teacher. Kenny Lizette Cuellar de Barrientos. Present. Linda Magali García Montoya. Luis Ernesto Gómez García. Present teacher. Marcos Amil Carmencía Gutiérrez. Marcos Antonio Melgar Pérez. Present teacher. Marielo Janet Cornejo Arazo. Marielo Janet Cornejo Arazo. Marina Vázquez, Marina Vanessa Vázquez Romero. Present teacher. Thank you. Estoy buscando a Marielos. No, right. Mm, ok. Osvin Alexis. Oh, Present teacher. Flores Hernández. Thank you. Uh, Sabrina Lizeth García Orellana. Present. Very good. Lizeth del Carmen Hernández Miss Smith. Present. And Fátima Denise Aguilar Márquez. Present teacher. Thank you, guys. Thank you. All right. Let me go back then. Guys, ¿cómo vamos? ¿Todo bien? ¿Con las sentences? Yes, teacher. Okay, very I, good. I, I always clean my desk in my job. Okay. Every day. Thank you. I always clean your desk. Very good. In my workplace. Good job. What about rarely? Who wants to give me an example with rarely? Guys? Example mm -hmm. with rarely? Mm -hmm. I rarely sing a song in public. Okay, perfect. Yes. I never. <laughs> okay, very good. What about hardly ever? Who wants to help me with hardly ever? Uh, 
Hardly ever is like uh, rarely, guys. I hardly ever take a nap at noon. Very good, okay. What about with seldom? Who can help me with seldom? I seldom visit my friends. Very good, I seldom visit my friends. Very good. Who wants to give me an example with sometimes using third person? Third person, guys. Third person singular. It's sometimes uh, words that choose, words, words that shoes. Where's that shoes? Those pairs of shoes. Very good. What about never? Third person singular. Never? Third person singular, guys? Who wants to help me with never? An example of never? He never. Mm -hmm. He never. Come back early. He never. He come, comes. Comes go back, early. back early. Very good. Good job, guys. Okay, we will stop right here. Si quieren pueden mandarme sus eh, sus respuestas al, al WhatsApp para yo verificarlas para chequearlas. But thank you very much for joining today's class, guys. Uh, it's time to go to sleep, okay, to go to rest. Thank you for joining to this class and thank you for being uh, Sasha's greatest students, okay? So see you tomorrow, guys, at same hour, okay, same link. And I hope you have an amazing day tomorrow, okay? Take care, have a have okay. sweet dreams, bye -bye. okay? Bye bye. Bye, bye. 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 Jennifer, you stay with me, please. Thank you. You too. Bye bye, guys. Okay, bye. teacher. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Good night. Good night, Julio. Hello, hello, Jennifer. <coughs> How are you today? I'm um, fine, teacher, and I'm a little sick. Really? You're sick? Yeah. I think. Do you, have a, do you have a flu? I think I have COVID, but um, the doctor, I, the doctor say me, I have sinusitis crónica oh my god and um but how do you feel do you feel mm, like okay not so good or do you feel like if it is a flu or hey, teacher hello i don't uh no lo estaba escuchando perdón Me oh, no worries escuchando. it's fine jennifer so, no, I, I wanted to ask you, how do you feel? I mean, do you feel it's, uh, okay, it's not complicated because in case you feel that it's getting complicated and it's not, nor it's not a normal flu, you better go to get the exam, right? Um, to get the test, the COVID test. I, the doctor, I say me, the doctor say me, I have sinusitis chronic. I, um, you mm -hmm. hear me? Yes, and, yes. Um, now I have tos. Mm -hmm. You have cut, okay. But, so, how do you say cut? Cut, cut. Uh huh, cut. Cut is, mm, is weird. Uh, mm -hmm. I, I never have cut. Really, and today you you got a cough. You have a cough. Yes. Yeah. Oh I, I I think I uh, think 
uh, is normally for my work in my work I speak I always speak that <laughs> se salió de lo normal la situación pero but I'm not moti moti motivated you're not motivated like in my class in my in my class the last the last class I was yeah. I was and I feel asleep <gasps> oh my god and, and it was because you were sick or it was because me dio, no, me dormí, pero me sentía mal. No pude, este, ay, yeah. ¿cómo hacerlo en inglés? You pero, couldn't. Yeah, you couldn't. No, mm. no, no, no podía quedarse como despierta. No quedé despierta y me dio mucha pena. Y yo dije, no, ahorita no, no puedo. Y ya yo sé las reglas de inglés corporativa, entonces fue como, ya, ¿para qué? O sea, I'm not uh, sound in my activities in the, in the platform, and uh, I, uh, me preocupé. You get, I, wor you get worried. I start uh, with uh, emotion, how do you say emotion? For, Emotion? for starting again my my English class mm -hmm. that um, I'm how do you say me cuesta escu eh, entender cuando mm -hmm. para escuchar <clears throat> sorry it's difficult for me to understand English okay um <clears throat> But and then uh, is 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 the most complicated for me is listen the listen listening listening, listening. Oh, okay I understand the listening in my um co work on my partner mm -hmm. uh, my compañeros your and, your classmates. Classmates um, speak um, so much English. Um, <laughs> Don't say that. You're good, Jennifer. <laughs> uh, you're good. I mean, at the very beginning, it's difficult to start again because you told me that you have uh, a much time with them practicing, right? But yeah. you're good. I mean, I know you have potential, uh, I mean, you have a potential, I know. And I know you can do it, Jennifer. So don't feel like that. If you ask me, Jennifer, I'm feeling, I'm feeling asleep right now. And I'm feeling asleep since 6 p.m. <laughs> and it is because I feel tired. But um, yes, obviously, obviously you will say teacher, but you are the teacher, right? You need to stay awake, and, and it had happened to me, Jennifer. Me ha pasado a mí. Tuve una clase last last year que realmente yo me sentía con muchísima pena eh, porque sí, yo me sentía demasiado cansada y yo una vez me quedé dormida con pena se lo digo, pero una vez me quedé dormida estaba súper cansada y creo que de estar así me dormí. Entonces lo que a mí me, por lo cual a mí me pasó esto es porque no, no, esa clase no participaba, porque no había mucha participación, entonces yo le entiendo, créame Jennifer, y creo que todos estamos cansados y creo que todos desearíamos dormir igual, y no es problema, <risa> créame que es algo normal, ¿verdad? Es sentir sueño y a veces sentir que uno se va a dormir, entonces por eso es que tratamos de hacerlo lo más interactivo posible, ¿verdad? Mi consejo sería, porque a mí me pasó, Jennifer, que se busque un lugar donde usted no se pueda quedar dormida, porque dice que yo, como alumna en esa clase, mi peor error fue ese día que me fui a, 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 fui a recibir la clase en un sofá que tenía en mi cuarto y me quedé dormida. Entonces, what happened to me. Uh, yes, yeah, so, I started to to look to another place, um, and that works for me. And I started to participate more. 
that's it. And it works for me. So eso me ayudó mucho. Eso podríamos hacer, Jennifer. Como le digo, no es pecado sentir sueño, no es pecado sentirse eh, cansado, claro que no. No se me desmotiva, usted es súper buena. Eh, yo la pude ver en esta clase y en las otras también. Eh, usted tiene las ganas de hacerlo. Entonces, si usted se mantiene así participando, créame que va a sentir que la clase pasó rápido <coughs> y no va a sentirse así. Así que participe más y ya verá que va a aprender y al mismo tiempo no se va a sentir así. Pero no participa más. Pues le digo por experiencia y se lo digo porque pues usted puede decir, no, pero es que usted es la teacher que también he estado como estudiante y también me he quedado dormido. Así que pues no se preocupe, es normal. La cosa es tratar la manera de, de ver opciones, ¿verdad? Porque pues al final sabemos de que pues este proceso tiene una recompensa, Jennifer. Y yes. pues me alegra que esté aquí. Me alegra, eh, yo realmente no le había escrito anteriormente porque dije, bueno, ya se va a conectar. Pero sí, luego vi que no se conectaba y dije, y se salió del grupo. Entonces dije yo, mmm, bueno, le voy a preguntar si todo bien. Dije yo, sí, <risa> nunca me imaginé eso, la verdad. Pero bien, qué bueno, sí, qué bueno tenerla aquí de nuevo. No se me desmotive, de verdad que la queremos ver aquí. <risa> Thank you. Now my job is to practice and not miss. No, no falta. Mm -hmm. Don't miss the class. Yes, I know, Jennifer. Yo creo que solamente fueron tres clases, ¿no? Yes. Vaya, sí. todavía sí. se puede. Claro que sí, todavía se puede. Lo que tiene que hacer es que estas clases que faltan, ¿verdad? Tratar la manera de no faltar. Si usted está ocupadita, porque a veces, mire, pasa que algunos, si usted se fija, soy antes de que van manejando, a veces están todavía en el trabajo, pero ellos se conectan, se conectan okay. por los minutos para que les cuenten. Entonces okay. ahorita tratemos de no, no faltar muchos minutos para recuperar esos tres días, ¿verdad? Y para okay. que al final tengamos la asistencia, yo le voy a ayudar en lo que pueda. Ahora le mandé la lista de reproducción. Realmente... Eh, Déjeme ver, vimos dos temas como mucho, como muy gramaticales, uno fue lo de los time expressions, eh, puede ver esa clase, puede okay. usted adelantarse si quiere Jennifer como al punto de la gramática, si usted quiere okay. aprender eso, y la clase que es, quiero ver time expressions, y la otra se llama could, uh, could be, and would be, could be and would be, how to use would be and could be, creo que se llama, entonces busque esas dos clases en la lista de reproducción que le mandé, véalas en el punto de la explicación, porque realmente nos estamos enfocando muchísimo en practicar mucho el speaking, también hay muchas cosas que, que si aprendimos, como por ejemplo, cómo nosotros podemos eh, responder en una interview, ¿verdad? En una entrevista, ¿cuál es, mm. cómo lo podemos responder? ¿Cómo expresar esa, cómo decir, nuestro educational background, ¿verdad? Mm. O nuestro work experience. ¿Cómo responder esas preguntas? Como por ejemplo, tell me about yourself también. Y les mandé también como un review de una, de una lista de, de preguntas que normalmente se hacen en una interview. Eh, no sé si usted la pudo obtener o ya se había salido, Jennifer. Yo creo que ya me había salido. My okay. idea, my idea, my idea was mm -hmm. to move forward so as not to fall behind in the platform. Um, But uh, I don't know. What happened with my activities? Because ah, pero todavía I, puede ingresar. Yes, but you send send me mm -hmm. uh, send me my activities the last last weekend or not? La de ella mandó las notas de la semana pasada porque yo ya yo completé uh -huh. eh, creo que me quedé hasta la tercera o hasta la segunda clase no sé porque tenía una duda y ya no avancé pero 
Luego avancé hasta la 10, pero fue hasta después, supongo yo, de que usted ya mandara las primeras notas. Sí, Jennifer, pero no hay problema, mándelas, siempre mándelas. Eh, okay. Y yo voy a ver cómo me envió las suyas y, y, y hablo con Insafor para que podamos actualizar esas, no se preocupe. Así que trate de ponerse al día con esas tareas, si tiene preguntas me dice. ¿Están dando errores en algunas? Okay, ok, yes, I have a question uh -huh. with a... Uh... Creo que es la número 4 que está dando error. Se lo voy a reenviar ahorita. Scrumble, scrumble, or I don't know. I will send it to you la que está dando error. Fíjese de que le voy a mandar esta para que la corrija en caso que le está dando error. Yeah. Es en the exercise number 2. Exercise yes. number two, uh -huh, exactly. This the one. scramble. Mm -hmm, the scramble yeah. one. But, mire, le voy a mandar, y hay una, la cuatro, que está dando error. Entonces, ahí le voy a mandar cuál es la que se tiene que poner, porque hay un error, de hecho, en el sistema. Entonces, por eso es que ahí se la mando, mire. Weekend soft will be a good option. Esa es la número cuatro. Entonces, se tiene que yeah. poner happy employees en vez de staff. Y esa se lo va a marcar buena. Solo happy. copielo y péguelo. Uh -huh. Ok, ok, ok. Happy employees. Ok. Um, you send me a message in my WhatsApp. Uh, or... uh -huh. Yes, I send it to you. Uh, I'm not see. I'm not see your message. Uh, the spawn. The spawn. The spawn. Se fue archivado. No. Mm, Se lo mandé ahorita, revise. Okay, okay, all right. I, I got it. Is correct. I got it. I got it. I got it. How do you say? Lo tengo. Mm -hmm. I got it. Perfect. Uy. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Yes. You're getting it. Perfect. Yeah. Yes. Okay. And uh, actually. Um, I, I had, uh, I had, ya hice. You did? I did? I did uh, 10 activities. Okay, perfect. 10 activities. <laughs> Great. Yes. Perfect. Jennifer, let's keep it up, okay? Let's continue doing the exercises, the activities, and if you have any questions, let me know. Okay. I will help you with this. Um, and I would like to know if you have any comments, any feedback, anything that I can help you with so you can feel more comfortable or you can continue in the class and don't miss classes, Jennifer. <laughs> <laughs> yes, teacher, I try. And thank you. Thank you for, for your motivation for me. Okay. And I, I work hard, hard work. <laughs> my English class. Yes, I know you will do it, okay? I know you will do it, Jennifer. Just keep motivated, okay? <laughs> I know you can do it, and I will continue helping you as much as you can, all right? Okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome, Jennifer. Do you have any other question or something else I can help you with? Mm -hmm. Teacher, okay. only that. Great. Good to see you again in classes and see you tomorrow, okay? Have a wonderful night, Jennifer. Good night, teacher. Thank okay, you take care. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.